going to explain one by one so for data sync go to contact builder data sources then click on internal tab named synchronized click on the tile uh, there is a button on the top right uh, is set up objects click on this once the pop-up will load uh, you see uh, there are three entities uh, which is uh, activated uh, for syncing uh, is user lead and contact once uh, we uh, synchronize these three entities uh, other entities uh, which is available uh, will be available for syncing okay so click on uh, the synchronize button one by one for each entity Uh, so uh, we set up uh, syncing for these three entities uh, it will take some time uh, to sync uh, once uh, these entities will sync uh, will verify in uh, ET uh, subscribers synchronized data extinctions uh, 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 separate separate DE will be created uh, for each entity like uh, user underscore salesforce lead underscore salesforce and contact underscore salesforce and uh, we need to verify the count also the count will same As you see the user entity is synced successfully so we need to verify this in uh, synchronized data expansion uh, a DE uh, has been created uh, named as user underscore salesforce and the record count is seven uh, and uh, the record count is seven already in uh, contact builder um, so it's verified uh, so we have to wait for another two leads uh, which is in syncing state Uh, lead is also seen uh, so refresh the synchronized data expansion folder lead underscore salesforce d is there contact underscore salesforce d is there the count for contact is 25 and the lead is 29 uh, verify this count is 25 and uh, lead uh, row, row count is 29 okay so uh, switch to the scenario sheet uh, we have covered uh, uh, top three scenarios uh, now move to uh, the scenario which is verify edit fields now uh, go to contact builder 
क्लिक ऑन कॉन्टैक्ट टाइल Uh, there is option on the right hand side to uh, edit fields click on this uh, pop-up will be populated so choose some optional fields like description first name and last name and click on save button uh, currently uh, we have 14 no no for contact is 10 10 field counts so uh, now this will take some time to update the field count uh, in et side uh, so we'll wait wait for that The current row count of for contact is 10 uh, it will be updated uh, and the row count will be uh, 13 uh, as uh, we have added three fields now it's updated the row count is 13 then uh, we can try to uh, delete or remove uh, a row row count will decrease to 1 uh, it's 12 Uh, I put a color mark uh, the scenarios which we have already covered okay next account synced So we have to wait for this to update is going side by side uh, so move to next scenario it's uh, verify refresh uh, for refresh uh, we have to add a contact or lead in salesforce Click on save. Go to data sources. Click on contact tile. Uh, there is a but icon refresh icon on the top right. Click on this. 
the current count is 25 it will be updated as 26 within some time account is saying verify this in ET so ID is created record count is 17 record count in 17 is ok we'll wait for contact refresh old count is 25 in ET also After refresh, the count is updated. It's 26. Refresh the synchronized data extension folder. The contact count is 26 also in this. So this scenario is also covered. Account sync is covered. So we uh, are going to set up these three scenarios uh in one step so click on contact click on pause go to contact uh, which we created before some time uh, make some changes in this like we are putting email address save now uh, we need to wait for 15 minutes uh, as per the poll schedule which is shown on the left panel okay so I'm going to pause this video just for just for 10 minutes will sync again after 10 minutes now uh, uh, we have to resume the sync so click on resume a sync button then a popper will appear uh, click on ok so wait for some time uh, and uh, verify uh, the email address which we updated in the contact uh, will sync in uh, DE now verify this in the contact underscore salesforce D. So track it with the first and last name so this is the contact uh, we have added earlier in Salesforce uh, currently the email address is not updated yet so wait for some more time to update
now uh, the email address uh, for our contact uh, is getting updated so you can see uh, highlighted data so this is all about uh, data sync uh, and thanks bye